After you watch this video, make sure to go get my 333 refill collection for free when you spend $33 at waverunners.com. These are some of the most rare refills and expansion packs for reason you'll ever find. Today, I'm gonna to show you more melody hacks used by today's top producers. Let's start with a simple three note scaled in D minor. First set the grid to 1 8 and put the chords in. Then change the grid to 1 4 and duplicate it for four bars. After that, take the middle note and move it over 1 8 then we can start changing the top notes, making sure you stay in key. Now we can erase these and replace them with this phrase we've just created. I placed a tonic note that plays all the way through, and then I'm going to add some bass notes. The bass notes are subtle, but I'm going to layer them with a synth bass next. For effects, I've added Ripley, Portal, and Sweeper. Now that we have the melody, let's add a synth bass. For this, we can just trace over the bass notes in the melody and move them up an octave. To add a tape stop effect, I used Effectrix. I set it to 1 fourth, filled in the last two squares on the X loop lane, and changed it to the down slapper preset. I wanted the sweeper to come in every eight bars, so I automated it by right-clicking the on switch, edit automation to add a new lane. Then I just set it where I wanted it to start at. With the 808, all we have to do is bring the bass notes down and move them up an octave to D3. Then we can take the razor tool and start slicing where we want the 808s to hit.
Now I'm going to lay the rest of the drums in and do a quick beat arrangement. I'll let the beat play out from here.